Hi, so in this first episode of Magical Voxel Quick Cuts, I will show you a way to increase your wall render size. So let's say you made this huge piece here. Um, this is my uh, latest upload to Instagram and it takes up the whole renderable world. So you can see here, if I go to render, obviously it just renders this tiny little cube because in these three little bars here, sparse is turned off. This is to save computing power. If you turn this on, it increases the size from this little block to a much greater size. However, if you notice, part of my building and most of the floor here is missing. But if you go to the model view, it shows everything. And in render, it doesn't show that at all. So let's go ahead and fix this problem. So go into your folder where you have Magical Voxel. You want to go to your config folder, double click that, and double click this config notepad file. It opens up a notepad and you don't have to worry about too much here. All you have to worry about is right here where it's under render, render in sparse buffer. It's at the 256, 16 by 10, um, 24 megabytes. You just want to change this from 256 to 512 and from 1024 to something like 2048, I find works. Uh, I believe this is based on um, either memory or video card. So just play around with this, don't go too high. Um, I would just keep these settings for now because as you'll see in Magical Voxel, everything will be fixed. Once you have configured your files in the notepad, you can close Magical Voxel and after reopening it, go back to the voxel file that you were having trouble with earlier. Go ahead and go to render. And then when you turn on sparse now, it should be able to load up the entire scene. Hopefully this video helped. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.